So we saw a lot of snow melt this weekend and with rain all day today and even more in the forecast, we wanted to know, has the spring flooding outlook changed? And Josh Frider asked the National Weather Service today. So the good news tonight is the short term is looking better than when it was when we first did the story a couple of weeks ago. That's because the snow was able to melt before any rainfall. But now with multiple chances for rain this week, that leaves a lot of uncertainty. The National Weather Service tells me there is still an above normal risk for flooding in all of southern Wisconsin in the coming weeks. You may be thinking, well, the snow is already gone, so what's the big deal? Well, in 2019, we saw the wettest year on record, and the ground is still so saturated from that. And because we received so much snow this winter, especially to our north, all of that needs to drain south, which means this is only the beginning. I caught up with Sarah Marquardt of the National Weather Service via Skype today. She says it's not just the rural areas that need to keep washed this spring. Even low-lying areas and urban communities could see flooding. Anyone is at risk with this flooding. Um, it's just a matter of who gets the heavy rain, how much rain there is, but anywhere where that water starts to pond up, there's that risk of flooding. Because that uncertainty remains high, emergency management directors from across the area say you should be preparing now before it is too late. That means thinking about flood insurance, sandbags, sump pumps, or elevating things in your basement if you typically see any moisture coming through. And of course, we'll be keeping you updated on any new information as soon as we get it. Guys, back to you.